All right. Okay, not the greatest matchup here. Mm. Would be a mirror matchup actually. He could just go for Fangs. Okay, no, he didn't. Arc lights. I'm glad I went for some snipers then. Special. Special choice. He's really finicky with his positioning. You get matched with 1.4. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, but you probably. Yeah, they don't then lose very much, do you? If you lose. Because they're that much higher than you. Oh wow, that's really nice. That's the dream scenario, I think. Oh, this guy placed his arc lights really well. On the outside while my snipers were on the inside. Unfortunate for me. Uh, it's also unfortunate that he's gonna lose. Oh, come on. Come on, shoot. Yes. Yeah, I think that's better, just to play against people who are higher MMR than you. That's You lose less and you win more, that's definitely better. Actually, you shouldn't be able to cancel the matchmaking once you see the your opponent. It's weird that you can do that, actually. Uh, let's skip here. I think we need some more marksmen. Wasp form, where's it going? Okay, on the back. That's gonna be annoying. We won't be able to deal with that. The fangs will be gone by then. And then we're gonna lose our sniper, the one who was supposed to take out that arc light. Ah. And this guy is protected by tanks. Are you kidding me? That is really unlucky. That's very unfortunate. That could be good here. You're right. I'm just trying to think ahead. What is he gonna do? Giants? Actually, Phoenixes are pretty good against that. Thank you, Creed. Have a nice evening. Storm colors? No, we've sworn off storm colors. We don't do that anymore. Storm colors are now the enemy. I knew he was going to try flank. What else did he get? More sledges. <laughs> oh, you were probably weren't here for that. We tried using storm colors like in the first three matches today. And they, yeah, they just got owned by the missile interception. So, unfortunately, the missile interception really killed my favorite unit. Fortresses are going to be good here as well. That's true. But Phoenixes will be as well. Let's try Phoenixes. As we're the, we're the aerial... We're the aerial specialist anyway, so... Uh, 
Should be good. This missile is gonna kill a lot as well. Nice. There we go, those are gone. Yeah, the Phoenixes are doing good work. Nice. No good way to counter overlords when your opponent can spam them. The best way to, I think, to kill them is have a lot of high level marksmen. But then again, yeah, he can just keep spamming uh, wasps. So you also need mustangs. It's hard to to predict. Sometimes overlords just seem to work for some reason. Uh, let's actually get a heavy armor and get that fortress. We need something to deal with this too, and I don't have anything. So let's just put a missile down there again. Alright. Okay, this is annoying. I don't have missile interception yet. But it's normal, it's not as good, I think. It should not be able to kill like two two units just by picking missile interception. That would be be a bit insane if it worked too well. Okay, the fortress is really working well with the increased HP. Without it, it would already be dead, for sure. I mean, obviously, because it's below a half HP, but... Yeah, that went nice. There we go. That should counter these storm colors by a lot. Do we just get the rocket punch? Why not? Uh, and what else? Oops. Let's unlock the overlords there free anyway. Oh crap, I still don't have anything to do with this. Uh, <laughs> another missile it is, I guess. Alright, let's go. Those are dead, nothing on that flank. Okay, he's going for his own fortress? Curious. I got a sniper advantage here and the phoenixes and the power fists. He's not even hitting the right targets. He's shooting the fangs, that's still there. Okay, these used, this guy used both his fists already. This guy doesn't use him very fast because he's got so much HP. Okay, nice. Oh, he's dead. Okay. That was a fast one. Very quick. And efficient.